Hi, friends. I bet you can't tell me who's on my shirt. That's right. It's Minnie Mouse. This is a shirt that I made when I went. I went to see Minnie and Mickey all the way down in Florida. And they, um, they, I made this shirt while I was down there. It was very special. This week is Mother's Day. And we read on Monday the book, The Dinky Donkey, which was all about the parent donkey being so proud of their uh, donkey. And remember by the end of the book, it said that Wonky Donkey had a child and she was so cute and small and had beautiful long eyelashes and she loved to listen to rowdy music and she painted her hooves bright pink and she had to go pee pee and she loved to play the piano and she wore wild sunglasses and smelled just as bad as her dad and she was a stinky funky plinky plonky winky tinky inky pinky punky blinky dinky donkey remember all that yeah so we are gonna take a page out of this book and we are gonna do some crafts for our mommies now you need to find a grown-up to do this craft with because some of the crafts require you to use things that you need a grown-ups help with and they need you to like write stuff and whatnot so you need to have a grown-up preferably not your mommy Maybe you can find an auntie or a grandma or a grandpa or a daddy and they'll help you. Parents, in your emails, I am going to send you one of these. So you're going to want this, crayons, and a marker. Now what you're going to do is you're going to sit down with your grown-up children and friends and you are going to put something special about your mommy in each of these circles and then and that's what's good at why how your grown-ups gonna help you and then you're going to wait for the marker to dry and then you're going to color it with crayons and it'll look something like this I made this one for my mommy it says I love my mommy because she is smart she cares about me she's funny she is a great cook she loves she tells great stories and she loves me and then down here it says love always Paige because that's what my mommy calls me she calls me by my grown-up name not by my teacher name all right and then the second thing I'm gonna send you is oh it's gonna end up colored but you'll want to staple it or somehow to attach it together you could even put like a ringlet here um, I don't have those here at my house, but something to connect them. This is going to be mommy's coupon book. It's going to have all sorts of things mommy can choose to do. So for this one, you're going to need the printout, which I'll send you. It's two pages. You're going to want to have scissors. These are for grown-ups to use um, unless they give you permission. And you're going to want to have crayons. Once it's printed, you'll go ahead and let your children decorate this however they'd like. And then you're going to help them cut it out. Now, these have my ideas on them. You can totally change these. The documents I'm going to change you is a Google Doc. And so you'll be able to um, change it, rearrange it, do something different. Um, one of them um, is the opener. It says Mommy's Coupon Book on it. But the other ones say Rub Mommy's Feet, Let Mommy Pick Out My Clothes, Help Mommy Clear the Table, Watch Mommy's Favorite TV Show, um, Eat a New Vegetable, Go to Bed Early, Give Mommy Extra Hugs, Wake Up Daddy Instead of Mommy. I like that one. Um, <laughs> give mommy the last piece of candy, let mommy pick the movie, play with mommy's hair, let mommy choose bedtime, sing uh, the bedtime story, um, sing mommy a silly song, have a dance party with mommy, or eat all my dinner. So these are all coupons that mom can choose. Um, so when you give these to her friends, when mommy, when, when you're grown up that's helping you make these, when they... Uh, when you give this to mommy, she gets to choose which one she's going to ask you to do. And you got to do it, okay? you got to do it with a grateful heart because mommies are so special. Mother's Day is there so that we can remember all the wonderful things that our mommies or our mommy figures do for us every single day. How they help us to 
um, just do everything, like get dressed or cut up our vegetables or um, help us when we're scared of monsters or when we can't get the TV to work. That's what mommies do. We're there for that. So I'm really excited to see how well you color all your crafts, how well you do everything. And I cannot wait to hear how much your mommies love their presents that you're going to give them on Sunday. All right. Okay, friends, I will see you on Monday with our next story, which I believe will be Sheep in a Jeep. All right, friends, bye.